Mysterious booms, they are shaking homes and people's nerves. Everybody can hear it, but nobody knows where it's coming from. It's a big noise in the small town of Clintonville, west of Green Bay. And it's really turned into an international mystery. Tonight, people came together as they searched for the source of the shake. Charles Benson is live in Clintonville with this bizarre situation. Charles. And getting more bizarre by the day. Now, a Waukesha company will be up here in the next 24 to 48 hours to install some monitors that will hopefully measure the vibrations on the ground. They're hoping that will lead to what's causing the booms and shakes. We just moved up here like four months ago, so obviously we're a little bit... A little freaked out. So, Nervous laughter as Clintonville residents pack the local high school to find out what's being done about all the booms and shakes that have put this rural community on edge. So is this freaking you out? Yeah, very much. Yeah, yeah. It, it's freaking me out. Rebecca Anderson was inside her boyfriend's main street business name Doesn't Compute when things started shaking on Monday. The counter around where my desk is, as you can see from the inside of the store, the computers are sitting on top of there. You could see the counter shake and the computer shake. And I jumped up out of my chair. I thought they were going to fall off. The mysterious booms are making national news and keeping local police busy with more than 500 calls in three days. One of the things you normally have to do in your life is ask people, well, what did you see? What did you hear? But in this case, you've heard it. Yes, I uh, felt it personally and uh, a significant one, I think. Finding out what it is may take a super sleuth. At this point, I want to reiterate that we hope to find answers for you. However, it is possible that we will never have a definitive answer. Now, a lot of people up here have their own ideas. Some people think it's the weathers. Others have some wild conspiracy theories, but really no one knows for sure. Reporting live on your side in Clintonville, Charles Benson, today's TMJ4. Charles, is anybody trying to cash in on all this attention? Well, there are some people talking about selling T-shirts. We're hearing some of the restaurants are offering free shakes with their burgers. So they're being a little bit lighthearted about this. Love the free shake idea. That's a good one. All right, Charles, thanks very much.